What is up guys? So welcome back to my channel. Wow, it's been a minute, like a long time. Is this good lighting? There we go. So it has been like a long time, honestly. Um, the last vlog that you guys saw was me being crazy at Lost Lands, and it was really cool to be able to share that with you guys, like that side of me. And I'm trying to like kind of find a balance, like a happy medium, like combining like my like shuffling, like dancer, like raver side, because I love music so much. Like it speaks so much to my heart. Like I love it so much. So I like to be able to like share that with you guys and like what music can do to you and how it can like bring people together and like it could just make you be almost like an ultra ego. Like it makes you really come out of your shell and that's what I love about it. But anyways, so now that you guys got a little bit of that crazy mosh pit crazy side of me, now you're gonna see my other side as well. Um, we are about to go to a crazy, crazy, crazy foodie adventure place. It's, a, it's episode two. Actually, technically this is episode one because there were some malfunctions on episode one before we went to Cheesecake Factory, but we lost some footage. All right, we're going to Dirt Dog Las Vegas. Um, there's actually two locations. We're going to the really nice, the nicer one, which is in Rainbow and Warm Springs area, kind of. Um, so we're gonna go there and we're gonna just like dive in. Like you guys will see, it's more of a greasy, salty. Um, food place so it's not like a cineholic it's not um like sweets or anything like that so we're about to go there stir is in my car there's mella that's my car's name and um yeah we're heading there right now and i will see you guys there okay in three two one we're here yes. guys Woo! dirt dog lv yes i right out here want Oh wait, we have to get like almost one of everything. True. Like a elote for sure. And we have to get Fries. the dessert. Oh, and the churro thing. How do I change this? Hold on guys, mount function, mount function. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, now we're in business. See? Oh, okay, there we go, yeah. Okay guys, so we are finally inside. There's a line out the door. Well, there was. We were outside, and now we're inside. Yes. And we're about to look at the menu. So they also have tacos. That's one of the newer things, actually. Yeah, the tacos. And then this is what I'm getting. What is the game plan, sir? So we have to get... You're getting the elote? Yes, the hachido one. Because that's their signature thing here. Is there a elote? Um, definitely fries, at least one set of fries. Okay. The mixture one. Fries. We're getting the horchata ice cream yes. and the, the twink, deep fried Twinkie. Oh, I wanted to try also the, the deep fried Twinkie, of course. Oh, nice. Um, Oreos. The deep fried Oreos. Oh, we're doing that too. Okay. What did you try last night? That's what I had, the deep fried Oreos. Because, guys, I came here last week just to, like, give it a little, like, t like taste bit, you know, like, to know what I'm getting myself into. So good. Why is yours so much brighter than mine? Look at the difference. Focus on this. Oh, because my I turned on my brightness. One, it's really Wait, only one? Are you gonna get two? I can't to be honest, I can't just I can't digest hot Do you know this? I have a lot of lactic acid, like a, oh acid reflux when I have a hot dog. Like I legit feel like they're up at the top of my throat the entire time. Okay. okay, fine. But is that the only one one serving we're getting, right? We're getting two fries. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do the fries two. two and then one hot dog. One okay. hot dog? Yeah, because you said you can't do it. I feel like we should do okay, one and fry it. and then two hot dogs. I could, just give, I could give some. I could give my my family the rest of the hot dog. Or I can eat it. Or you can eat it. <laughs> okay. Also, guys, we've been we've adjusted everything like our diet so we can specifically do one foodie adventure episode once a week. So once a week. be patient with us. Yes, we're trying to get in the groove of everything on this new season of life. Literally, that we're trying to stabilize everything, not trying to overwhelm each other. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Over there and over there. Okay. Hold up on the rose, they speak the best life, blah, 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 bl
this is about to be real life in my hand in three, two, and boom. In real life. Yes! Guys, look at this. Food porn central. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty good. Yes. Okay. Cue music right now. Now. Dun, 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 dun. It's our music. I know. I literally hear music in my in, in my head. head. Bitch, I'm awesome. Like um, like a really like intense like cheat meal or treat meal more so or like you know like if you're gonna have donuts or like something that's like out of your like meal plan or you're gonna go a little crazy make sure to always um, have some sort of micronutrients in your system before. Sister mentioned this in her last vlog when we went to Cheesecake Factory so but that footage got lost so make sure you watch it on hers though it's really great. <laughs> So just make sure that's a really like helpful like foodie tip. Make sure to fill up on some micronutrients before and lots of water, obviously. Okay. All right. So guys, we got the elote hot dog, the hot Cheeto, um, corn. Well, not corn. Yeah. 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 Hot Cheeto elote. Hot Cheeto elote corn. And um, literally, yeah, I said hot Cheeto. Repeat, hot Cheeto. On. Corn and the elote fries. So we're about to dig in because I'm so hungry and I'm so Is excited like right that? now. <laughs> A lot, but not in a bad way. Like it's um, it's definitely it's like a little zesty. Yeah. It's almost like zesty, mm -hmm. like yeah. zesty in the fries. And then they have like the cookie the cheese and the bacon in there, which I haven't really seen right. There's also corn in it, so oh, it's bomb. The corn in that has like the powder in this. Yeah. This is the, elo the elote hot dog. So it's literally what it, we just ate, the fries, but in hot dog version. Okay. Mm -hmm. So here we go. It has the same exact components as the fries. So. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> that reaction. Sorry. <laughs> Your reaction is. Is that bacon? Mm hmm. It was bacon wrap. Okay, that's what I was trying to figure out in my head. The bacon is has a, adds a lot of flavor, a lot. It makes it really like juicy. 8.5, mm -hmm. 8.5, almost nine. What about on the um, on the fast food scale? Oh, it's gourmet, 100. <laughs> percent Like 11 out of 10, <laughs> for sure. Yeah. Where we at though? I'm like. Hey guys, so I'm like extremely excited for this one. This was probably like. Like I'm really excited stuff. for this one because I am the biggest fan of hot Cheetos like so so much Me and stir always eat tell them what we eat 
So this is like epic, this is super true. So for those of you out there who are willing to do this, we have yes. hot Cheetos, we put lime juice on it. And like we dump it in a bowl and put lime juice and then we put this thing called picositos, it's like a Mexican Lucas mm -hmm. on top. Like this, sweets. Yeah, this is like the mother load of that. The yes. fact that that is right there. Yep, yep, yep. And the last time I came here, which was last week, they like, did not have this. They, they uh, sold out. So I'm like, oh my super gosh. excited. Okay, there we go. Oh my gosh. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, look at that. Oh my god, it's for the viewers out there. <laughs> For you, <laughs> dude, that is insane. Sir, no, mind blown. no, yes, <laughs> no, yes. yes, guys. Literally, is what you would expect. The corn is such a big texture thing, which mm. I have totally said that in the fries. It's super texture, like a lot. Obviously, what seals the show is definitely the hot Cheetos. It has so much flavor. So, so I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it because I love hot Cheetos. It seals the show. The cheese adds a really good, like, warm, warmness to it. It's not too salty. It's more just hot. So that's what I like. I appreciate that a lot about it because the hot dog was really salty because of the bacon. This isn't as salty. It's more on the hot side. Um, and then the cilantro, you can't really taste it honestly too much because the hot Cheetos is really overpowering it. So, yeah. Nice. If you don't like hot Cheetos, honestly, you won't like this because it steals the show. Honestly. Okay. So. so it's like the, the main thing? Yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. So this is the dessert portion. Okay, so we have horchata ice cream. Um, I'm assuming that's almonds or some sort of nuts on top with cinnamon. With like pecans or something. Pecans and cinnamon, yeah, and then obviously cinnamon on top. And then obviously the churro. I think it looks like it's not too oily, which I'm, that's honestly why I don't like churros, to be completely honest, which is really weird for me to say because I love sweets. Yeah. But usually I don't really like churros because they're too oily. Like, I just feel like I'm, like, literally eating oil. Yeah. So, this doesn't look like it's too oily, so I'm excited. Okay. But, okay. So I'm going to get this. <laughs> Oh my god. Double whammy. Mm. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Dang it. Wow. What's the verdict? One out of ten, honestly, nine point eight. Whoa. Yeah. <clears throat> I just I, I'm speechless. Literally like it's everything that I would want. The ice cream isn't too, too sweet. Um, there's not too much cinnamon on the churro, but if you think like it's gonna be overpowering the cinnamon, because sometimes cinnamon can be a little too much. No, the thing that I feel like they exceeded at was adding those nuts, and I think it's because I'm such a texture person. The nuts on top, wow. Like, that was such a great like finish too. Yeah. So good. She looked at me and said like, where we at though? I'm like. <laughs> Guys, so this is a fried Twinkie. This is like the, the creamy whipped cream. It's kind of like whipped cream. Um, I'm assuming they're trying to like kind of recreate what's inside already a, a Twinkie because when you first bite into it, obviously you don't get all that creaminess, so you can just like, keep dipping. Um, I honestly wasn't a big fan either of Twinkies when I was little, like at all. My mom never got them for me because they were so unhealthy. Mm -hmm. like, I think I've had, honestly, like maybe four, and that's saying a lot in my entire life. Yeah. Maybe four in my life. Maybe. So, we'll see how it goes. Let's see. What kind of expectations we have. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, you finish? got like three, three videos, different angles. Hello, guest star. Okay, guys. Well, let me take one more bite. Going back to it. One more bite. Yes. Look at that. <laughs> Whoa. Yes. Like, Honest opinion. Honestly, like, the, the greasiness is very overpowering. A lot. Like, it was like me barely even like touching it too, too much. Ooh, oh, there it is. Oh my god. Yeah. That's a lot. Yeah. That's a lot. So literally, if you literally if you're trying to like go ham, like what Sarah was saying, like go ham on something like you like you want 
a treat meal for sure. This is your go-to. It does remind me of a donut, like a like a literally like they just took it out of the fryer and you just eat it. Like that's how it reminds me of. But actually, if you don't like sweets too much, like if you're very like sensitive to that, like you just like you just don't like sweets too much. This actually you would probably enjoy this. It's not too sweet. It's more like a cakey, more cake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. Cool. So, yeah. Um, one to ten, honestly. LV coming at you live. Big girl foodie adventures. What's up? Hey, that code for a 10% discount. Just kidding. I wish. <laughs> Sponsor me. Sponsor hey. hashtag. So that concludes this week's Big, Big Girl Foodie Adventures. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next uh, adventure. We literally have a list, so we have a lot of good stuff. Yeah, it should be like we should be uploading these every Monday, Tuesday. Yeah, roughly. Monday. So, mm -hmm. so Monday. yes. See you guys in the next one. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. <laughs>